Give me a second. grandson Daniel on his 30th birthday. One day after you were born, I am sitting down to write you a letter which hopefully will fall into your hands at a time when you will not only be able to read, but also to understand what it is I am telling you. And it is quite possible that when you read this, that I, your grandfather, is not among you anymore. Whoa! That I, your grandfather, is not among you anymore? That's a trip! What is this? It's a 42-page letter from my grandfather. Jeez. It's not a letter, that's a damn novel. I found this with him, man. It's like his passport. Foreigner's residence certificate. Name, Donut Wood. Donut. Oh. Donut Wood. <laughs> Nationality, stateless. Stateless. No home. No nationality. A refugee. Yeah, man, in between states. Yo, did you know anything about this? I knew, like, little bits and pieces, like. Little bits and pieces, like. My dad walked into the room with this manila envelope in his hand. This letter is yours now, he said. Little bits and pieces, like. This is the last piece of my grandfather I can still hold with my hands. Like my mom's mom? My grandparents. I think it only goes back as far as my mom. German. I swear to God, my pops was a hustler, though. <laughs> Jewish. Had to be with eight kids. German Jewish. Oh, no, mom's was a Jehovah's Witness. That's confusing. <laughs> Yo, I never felt poor. And, and my grandfather? Not till he died. He died that year. That was when I found out about the rest of my family. See, I remember crying. I didn't know my dad's parents, but I knew his sister. She was the one that found out. Danny, why are you crying? It isn't really Shepard. It's supposed to be McGloster. But I didn't stop. Fuck it. Shepard could be the name of some other slave master. Wolf. That's a stage name. Our last name is supposed to be Isaac or Isak. He who will laugh. Never thought about it that way. My grandma didn't talk about the past, only the future. I don't really know that much about my family. And my grandfather said nothing. Silence. And it was the silence that taught me never to ask again. Yeah, not from here. 
outsiders. What am I doing here? I can't stay here. It's always been dangerous to ride this hemisphere. I don't belong here. I, I'm not from here. I don't feel right in my skin on the street with my fear here. Bill, come in! <laughs> yes! You are Don Wolf! Uh, uh, ich bin Jens. You're Jens. Yeah, my name. I am an artist. I write the, top, the text to your great grand uncle song on the X dot Yom Mitten to the barn on the street. Then all the people come out of the house and they say, You cannot write on my sidewalk. I will punch you with the NASA. <laughs> then I tell them what song it is on the X dot Yom Mitten to the barn. Then all the people know. They know this song. And the ex on your own in Tulipan, in the inner hand and butter brought me case. Wunderbar. Sprechen Sie Deutsch? Oh, I know a few words. Meine Kinder. Oh, my child. Meine Liebe. Oh, my love. Scheiße. Ah. Yeah, the important words. She. Yeah. <laughs> right, you know the Tulipan song? No. Oh, this is a very famous song. Everybody knows the text of this song, but nobody knows who wrote this text. You understand? <laughs> okay. Ludwig Ball, your great grand uncle, wrote this song in 1911. Uh, 1911. And all the Hamburg people know this song. And the ex young met Dunaban. Ah, it's a song about the boy with the hoop. So the song is about a toodle bond. A what? A toodle bond. Toodle bond? No, no, toodle bond. Huh. <laughs> what the fuck is a toodle bond? <laughs> it's a hoop. Oh. Like a circle. Like a hula hoop. Soda. So you swing it around your waist? No, you roll it. Like a ball? Like a hoop. It's a hoop, right? <laughs> OK, so it's kind of like a hula hoop that you roll like a ball. And you hit it with a stick. <clears throat> so it's like stick ball. No, no, you chase after it. Uh, someone pitches it to you. OK, it's a hoop, right? Okay. But you, but you roll on the ground like this, and you try to keep it going with the stick. Oh, it's a game. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Exactly. See, the kids, they took the hoop from the middle of a wooden barrel, right? And they made a game out of it. Huh. They made a song out of it. The kids? No. The Gabruda Wolf. The Gahooty who? You didn't hear the guy tell us about the song? No, man, I tuned dude out. I thought he was speaking German. <laughs> On the ex state young mitten Tudelbahn. <laughs> And the Anna and the Boda broke the case. Nursery rhyme. Then he blows me with the bane in the tutor con. On the leg he okay all in up the net. On he razzle me and dazzle get and can steam. On he kicks the guns to who rig up the tongue. Then he upsides the kitty hat and it by dawn. Does it wax was on hamburger young? <laughs> <laughs> Butter bread with cheese. Ah, that's why you did that. <laughs> Hopefully he doesn't stumble with his feet. Uh -huh. Oops, there he goes. Yo, he falls and hits his nose. Yeah. And he wrestles with his head against the curb stone. And he bites his tongue to steep inside his throat. As he jumps up, he says, check me a bulletproof. That's nothing, nothing for the Hamburg City youth. Clown, clown, as we're building clown. Roop, zoop, over and down. I need the avocado as Nick Jan who's out Hamburg sign. English, please. Steal, steal, apples, people, steal. Quickly, let's get over the fence. Uh -huh, come on, kick it. Not everybody can do this. <laughs> you must be from Hamburg City. Yeah. For centuries, on corners and cyphers, we congregate. Stout to make the world dance, more art it elevates. Stood in line for bread and cheese, governor. Please, we a nation of refugees from overseas. 
Survival tactics, survivalists from the action brought by racist factions. Only mathematics, they fuck with this attraction. Attract weak minded, right white Aryan devil practice. Before we concentrated in camps, temples were destroyed. I burned bright like AJ oil lamps, so cats and crimson don't stumble. I battle contemporary gladiators who want my world to crumble. For years, I call this a comeback. You better ask where I've been to arrive where I'm at. Well, by the base, simple twist of fate, USA. Went back in time to see if I could still relate. I steal my future back, who stole my past. I fed a culture, they fed us gas. And now I'm back to get clean for future scenes. Dreams led me to my voice and to my clutch. I steal my future back, who stole my past. I fed a culture, they fed us gas. And now I'm back to get clean for future scenes. Dreams led me to my voice and to my quest. So, yeah, help me find my history. Help me find this wealth. Love me unconditionally. Teach me how to carry weight inside myself. One, because I love it. Three, I'm in between. The two and the four, that's how I claim my history. They have 40 days and 40 nights. I got one mic to do it right. Taylor who didn't give Jesus Wasser. So the church in Europe said, this Jew has to run around the world for all times. He has to run around the world till the new Messiah will come to the earth. That is a Hasma. The Ibiga Yuda. The Ibiga Yuda. A wandering Jew. But what is a hospital? You don't get it. No. A hospital is this dude that didn't give Jesus water on his way to being crucified. So these religious motherfuckers decided that they were going to put it in their Bibles and in their textbooks, etch it in stone, carve shit in wood, that you Jews have to wander forever. It's like, it's like being a step or two ahead. Right? Just to get by. It's like poor people on the come up and the get over and black on black crime and, and the animosity towards the white man while still smoking his crack. It's like cutting your own legs off to sell them for food instead of using those legs to walk and find your ass some work. It's like, uh, it's like, it's like, it's like, it's like this. Like Ooh, here, look. This is Noingang, a concentration camp from near Hamburg. They make bricks to rebuild Hamburg. That is the point. Beautiful pictures, crazy history, the space in between. I don't just say, look, six million a day. I show what continues. You, me, me. Strasse. Hey, Strasse means street, yeah? Stupid. <laughs> My first place was in the Rentzelstrasse. Ah, this is the street where your grandfather was born. Yeah. One day when I walked to school from St. Pauli to the Grindelhof, passing on the way a bridge over a railroad, when a boy about my age shouted at me, Drecking or you the? What did you say just now? Dirty Jew. And took off with my cat. A man coming out of a restaurant at that particular corner shouted to the other boy, Hit that dirty Jew! In my misunderstanding, I thoroughly beat the other boy up, took my cap, and went my way. Scheiße! <laughs> <laughs> Shit is an important word in the German language. Just start a conversation with a German man, and that word was it? Sh -sh 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 
Shiza passes lips. And although it's the only dirty word that all you Americans know, it ain't taught in school, it ain't sung in the church, yet this word is everywhere. Tip of my tongue, the wall, the bottom of my shoe sometimes, because it's like, oh, Shiza really means, oh, no. But the German adds the word shit just for fun. I don't give a shit about it means I do whatever I please. To cheat is called to shit, and a, a shitter is always called a miser. Sh sh shizer. <laughs> when you're up to your eyes and shit, you keep your mouth shut. Ooh! Damn, you scared the shit out of me, you little shit. Oh, when you're walking down the street, any street, but especially on the rape bond, watch out for you. Sh 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 shizer! <laughs> My grandparents were sick because of this shit. And they all died before their time. But I guess shit happens, right? I got that one. Yeah, yo. Shit happens. Woo! It's old school, baby. It's a steamy hot track. Oh, be side. Ooh, it's a steamy hot track, man. 62, 63, something like that. Shiza! <laughs> Shiza! <laughs> Shit happens! I love that part. Shit happens! <laughs> it's gonna be shitty, yes? <laughs> Oh, <laughs> This is the spot. It's like a park. Oh, it isn't. It wasn't. This is Noingama, a concentration camp. Prisoners registered and were given colored badges. Red is for political prisoner. Green is for professional criminals. Black is for prostitutes and gypsies. Pink means you're homosexual. Purple was used for Jehovah's Witness. And yellow is for the Jews. Prisoners registered, had pictures taken, and were sent to showers. They were shaved of all body hair given prisoners uniforms and colored badges. A red triangle is for political prisoner. A green triangle is for professional criminal. A black triangle is for prostitutes and gypsies. Pink means you're homosexual. Purple was used for Jehovah's Witness. And yellow is for the Jews. The prisoners wore at first the usual blue and white striped zebra uniforms. Later, when they ran out, the SS distributed plain clothes which had belonged to murdered prisoners, marked by a yellow cross in paint. Daily routine. Way before the sun came up. Before we did our normal prison duties. 4.30 a.m. Wash, eat breakfast, make beds. Work started at 6. Roll call! We had to move boxes of candy and bags of flour and sugar. All ingredients for pies and cakes and pastries and shit. I don't know what it was for, but none of it was going into the prison. We ain't never had no cake up in the prison. Lunch break. Then work again. The stuff was underground and... Roll call! We had to heave it up to a person on ground level. And that person would heave it up into a truck. The guys heaving it up into the truck had it bad because they had to throw them just right so they don't drop the box or burst the bag. Punishment! We weren't working fast enough. The piece of shit guards would poke us in the back of the neck with sharp sticks. It didn't help us. Sometimes we got so frantic that we would drop a box or burst a bag or something. Everybody got beat for one person's mistake. Dinner! One person made too many mistakes. Them motherfuckers would piss on you or take away your food later in the mess hall and give it away. Roll call! It got really bad. 
They would either cut conjugal visits or make you watch while they fuck the lady that came to see you. You know what'll happen to your man if you tell anybody about this right. End of story. Punishment. They got what they wanted. You got what you deserved. Worst part about it was the guilt you felt fucking everybody else up when you fucked up. You thought it was bad when the guards got you. Big time. It was way worse when you got back to the cells. They were pitting us against each other and we couldn't even see that. Some fucked up shit. Hamburg history. What? It says Museum for Hamburg History. Museum for Hamburgische Geschichte. Something like that. <laughs> uh, how you like that? Hamburgische Geschichte. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Hey, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. These are them, right? Yeah. On these posters. Woohoo! Yo. Oh, man, what about those records? Dude, your family's got records and pictures in a museum. Ha! Huh. You're famous. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. They were performers. You're a performer. It's in your blood, blood. <laughs> Weird. Uh -huh. I feel like everybody's looking at us. Everybody is. <laughs> what the fuck are they looking at us? Us? You, who? Me. This is really weird. Whoa. This is a press conference. <laughs> this is really, really weird. I'm talking to you, but I'm not even looking at you. <laughs> uh, yeah, just act like we're talking to each other. <laughs> <laughs> what am I supposed to do? No, oh, man, they want you to talk to them in German. I don't know German, man. I don't know any of this. <laughs> it's your family. <laughs> Hi. Hallo. Ich bin Dan Wolf. But du brauchst keine Angst zu haben. Don't be scared. This is our place now. Welcher ist dein Großvater? Ha! Welcher ist dein Großvater? Yeah. Oh, sprechen Sie Deutsch? No, I don't speak German. Ah, English. <clears throat> Which one? is your great-grandfather. Which one is my great-grandfather? Yeah, point to him, bitte. That one, on the right. Ah, that one, are you sure? Yeah, of course I'm sure. My Omi told me. Your Oma, your grandmother? No, 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 Omi, my great-grandmother. What? She told me she once saw them perform in Berlin. Ah, yeah, so do the one song. This is very famous song. You will sing it. <laughs> you will sing now. I can't sing. <laughs> Growing up young boy in California, did you sing the songs of the Brother Valve, uh, the Brothers Valve? No, I, I didn't know them. Uh, Otto? <laughs> I'll be the same. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> Man, they snapped your picture and bounced. Hamburgish. Boring. Hey, Dan Wolf. Dan Wolf, over here. Over here, sing for me. Dance for me. Tons. Shopping job for me. Fucking crazy, man. It's like some fucked up way for them to change their history. They want answers. These Germans, they know more about my family than I do. I, I got nothing to say. Nobody told me anything. I know nothing. Then make some shit up. What? Man, make some shit up. What do you mean by make some shit up? If you don't know me by now. <laughs>
Doch. Now I'm here, so now what? So now what? 
ask my homies first. Excuse me. Uh, in Schuldigum. Can you please tell me where Leopold Wolf is buried? You are Dan Ball. Yes. I see your picture in the newspaper. Huh. I think it is very great that you come to Hamburg and follow in the steps of your great grandfather, especially since the history is so. But yes, you know. I'm glad you come here to Ostdorf. Many people come to see the graves and ask about him and her. I know Kate's the name, look on the chart for the stone, but Leopold Bob, I know where he is by heart. Follow me. I must tell you something. Uh, I knew Leopold. I was just a boy. But my father knew. My father was a butcher like Leopold's mother. One day, he called me to him at his shop. He tells me, closes the blinds, and he shows me his overcoat, and instructs me to put this on. He then begins to Bill inside, hangs a sausage here around my neck, whatever else he can fit, meat, cheese, told me, go to Kippenstrasse, to a Juden house, a house for Jews. My father couldn't do this. He was a grown man, and the Nazis would have searched him right away. But I, I, a young boy, went inside, emptied my coat, and out fast. I could not stay in this Juden house. At every noise, my heart was pounding even harder and faster. But I did this for my father. And I did this for Leopold. I respect Leopold. I never told this to anyone before. I went to visit a friend from my office, and I met and fell in love with Ali Berlin. Everything would have been fine and dandy until Ali happened to become pregnant. <laughs> our efforts to find a doctor to make an abortion were fruitless. And so our son, Dan, was born. Oh, uh oh, Dan! Dan Wolf, while ich Dan Wolf bin. This is where you got your name? Wow. In November 1938, a great number of Jews were arrested for no other reason than being Jewish. I was spared. That was the moment when it became evident that our life in Germany was no longer possible. I wrote to every country in the world. Thank you, but no. Many times. Unless you have a large sum of money, no. When I lie awake, I think of you. I think about this letter and how shall I continue writing it. The Jew Donut Wolf wants to get married. All marriages. He wants to marry a German. Here the case interests us. Between a Caucasian and a Negro. It is of double interest. Between a white person and a Negro. 
Because it takes place. Or a white person and a person of Negro descent. At a time when the German public was clearly advised of the shame of mixing races, and no German can say he does not know anything about this point. Having one eighth or more of Negro blood. He knows what he is doing. Shall be null and void. He knows that he is disregarding the feelings of millions of our nation's citizens. We do not demand of There shall be separate buildings. To understand. Not nearer than one fourth mile to each other. German customs. One for white boys. Nature and feelings. And one for Negro boys. He is not of our blood. White boys and Negro boys. He will never be able to understand us. Shall not in any manner. He follows the blood laws of his own race. And those laws are not the laws of our nation. Shall not in any manner be associated together or work together. Jew remains. You. The impact, the aftermath, the image I project. The people I affect, the last in effect. Who I do and don't respect. The way I react is because of the way that you act. It's all a power trip, man. It's all a power trip. These pigs suck a dick pump, bitch. Yeah. Got a grip full of lies. It's false facts, false ideals, and denials. People bought and sold, murdered, raped, burned, disavowed. I hate the disrespect. How could I ever forget? How shall a man describe the days before he's going to leave his home, his wife, his son, and everything he believes to be his future? I still see myself leaving the house, only standing there with our son in our arms. Hamburg, Germany. We arrived in Shanghai. Shanghai, China. I received a letter. Dan and Oli have been deported to Riga. Riga, Latvia. Language everywhere. Groups of young women walk the streets in fur coats. The men at the bar are drinking vodka until limp and lifeless. Oh, if you look on a map, we're not that far from Moscow. Riga. Where they were led into the forest and shot by the Nazis. Says Platz der Jüdischen Deportierten. Place of Jewish deportees. <clears throat> this is the place where thousands of Jewish people started their journey from Hamburg to the concentration camps in the death. In the year 1933, lived in fear and swanced thousand Juden in Hamburg. I thought you didn't know German. Only when I have to. Platz der Jüdischen Deportierten. Place of G Jewish Deportees. Im Jahr 1933 liegt in Fear in Zwanzig Tausend Juden. 24,000 Jews in Hamburg. This is the place where thousands of Jewish people started their journey. I wrote to this beat, open window, open fleet. Altona took the key. Miss the 
the week of my birth. I, Dan Wolf, am writing you a letter so that one day you will be able to read and to understand what it is I am trying to do. I know I have to walk the streets, see the places, feel the cold snow where this all happened, retracing footsteps like skin with my fingertips. This is all very real. So real, I can feel it. I'm here. Fuck you. I'm here. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck you. I've seen so much shit to make a grown man cry, but also felt the love on the quest to survive. So ask me why. I came back to this place to seek the ghost who never rested as the roots of my grace. Depressed to the pressure, we make the spot hype stay. Come in and collect it as I hit the spotlight. Times and at the hall, all is crawl in the pond. Up on the ramp, up on the cliff, all the toss. The sunlight flashes, y'all. We train and catch, it's time to concentrate. I never hesitate, and we blast and elevate. I speak my mind about my race, I'm always coming on point. So much wisdom passed around, it's like the smoke in the joint. Get learned about all these years of history. Back in your face, you act as if you really kissing me. Visibly, we both pay, the story lives in me. I'll give respect until respecting what you're giving me. After the demise of my father, my mother, together with my brother, was the owner of a theater in Hamburg. Your family owned this place? Yep. The Operette and House Theater, man. He who offers a lot offers something for everyone. Group um die Auster, the spectacular Hamburg Song and Dance Review, presented in the Operetten House Theater for over 300 performances, has been accompanied by a success that even the greatest operetta melodies have not known to date. The review is Hamburg's talking point of the day. Night for night, storms of applause tear through the auditorium of a packed house. The production offers an impressive Hamburg scenario in which, inspired by everyday life, one very comical scene follows the next. Entirely <laughs> mellifluous. <laughs> Hello? Hello? This place is huge! Huge! Now then, look. 1,400 seats. Damn. How'd they lose it? I don't know. While I've been writing so far, I thought I mentioned at the beginning that my name is Wolf. As a matter of fact, my real name is Isaac. And on account of the fact that your grand-grandfather Leopold was a comedian and acted under the name Gabruda Wolf, the Brothers Wolf, we obtained permission from the Hamburg Senate to change our name to Wolf. That is the name under which your father was born and which you are carrying now. Hello? Anybody home? Hello? Hello? Ich bin Dan Wolf. Uh, me too. Ich weiß. I know. My father told me you would come. Du brauchst keine Angst zu haben. Don't be scared. It's safe here now. This is Unterraum, our place. Uh, Leopold had this at here to 1924 and Swansea You're the first out of familiar both to stand on this stage for over 60 years, yeah? It feels to I'm feeling. I don't feel like playing games. Did you know our family used to be famous? Yeah? They were banned from singing their own songs. Yeah, the Nazis said they were too German for Jews to sing. Well, do you know our last name used to be Isaac? Yeah, Deutsche Leute would say Isaac. In Hebrew, it's Yitzhak. Yeah, that means to laugh. You know, 
town named after you? Your father met my grandma in Shanghai. When they came to New York, they had my father, an only son just like you. If you would have lived, I may never have been born. Thank you. While I lived in Germany prior to the advent of the Nazis, I, I felt myself to be German by birth and never thought of becoming anything else. The fact that I'm Jewish did not enter my mind as a hindrance. As often as I have visited Hamburg, the events which led to our fleeing Germany made me realize that I do not belong to Germany anymore. But the question arises, do I belong to America as I once belonged to Germany? The question arises, do I belong to America the same way? I, I, I know like little bits and pieces like, 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 like nationality, yeah, nationality, stateless, stateless, stateless. stateless. To my grandson Daniel on his 30th birthday, one day after you were born, I am sitting down to write you a letter so that one day you will not only be able to read, but also to understand what it is I am trying to tell you. State this. I'm the ex state young and making tutor bond. In the honor and the border book, the case. Ha! Very close, sneaky, and the tutor net. On the big and deep oak, all in open days. Ha! On the other hand, the making dads will get the same steam. On the other hand, the who rig up the song as he falls right to the head and play dumb. That's it. Right. 